Here we have Windows 8.1 Pro. This is the release to manufacture version. And we have Rufus, a USB utility that can really help us make bootable media. But it can also help us nuke a, or recycle an ESXi hypervisor installed flash drive. Uh, let me explain. Let, let's get started by downloading the utility. No install needed. I like to throw things in a, a folder, in this case, util. OK, we're done downloading. Next. Launch it by double clicking. Say yes to user access, excuse me, user account control. And do we want to allow it to check for application updates? This is an option. We can uh, change the schedule or we can just say no. We just want to run it at this point. And now I'll point out that last question we were asked is only asked once. It then saves it in one small registry key entry that um, you know, you've expressed your preferences. You don't want to be nagged every time you launch it. So for the second start, you won't get that nag screen. OK, zero devices found. Let's stick the USB drive in. It instantly found it. I didn't click scan or anything. That's good. Here's the interesting thing. If we have a look at that drive over in Windows Explorer, we'll find it's weird, right? It's only 4 meg. This is a 4 gig uh, drive. And is there anything we can do about it? Uh, not really. If we hit Windows plus X and go to Computer Management and look at Disk Management, you'll see it's this weird tiny thing. But formatting it doesn't help. Let me show you that. Just to really convince you, we need a tool like Rufus to handle that. There are other tools, but this one happens to be faster. So we use a plain old Windows format. We say restore device to default. Something like trying to get it just back to pristine state to use for other tasks. And the darn thing is still tiny. So we can use Rufus for this. Go here for MBR partition scheme. Put free DOS on there. And then just click Start, because it's on quick format mode, and it's going to go really quickly. That's it. Three seconds. Done. Now if we go here to convince you I've done something, we now have a 4 gig drive. Hmm. Well, I just renamed it, but let's actually do a quick format. Restore device default, sand disk, and say Start. It nukes all the data on there. And now we have an empty drive ready to repurpose and reuse. Now that we're done, we can go ahead and safely eject it. That's it.